started with just a basic melody. That's the verse, I'll play the bridge next. I'm a little flat there. But I want to tell you this. <coughs> I see a lot of pickers whenever they start really getting that end of the guitar down but before they start putting the bass line with it they start dangling on, on, the, on the roots a little, little bit like a banjo player would do more like Chet did that on his version I'll slow it down so you can see it with the camera twice back to back. Now the first time I'm going to play it more like Chet with a high melody going what, what, what the actual song is. F C 5 G Now I do a version I've heard other people play of that same bridge where instead of playing the melody, you just play a bunch of chords. So the, the chords are C, E, A minor, G, F, then back to C. Now every time I play that part of it, I, I variate it. So like it's C, E seventh, A minor seventh, G seventh, and then F. Or I'll go like C seventh, E ninth, A minor seventh. And then uh, like G seventh into an F. So it, basically the roots are st uh, the same in each one. E, A, G, F. But I might just color the chord a little different every time. So here's that part. Here's another variation of that. And the whole time you pick is on the roots and it's it, it root of each chord. But at the same time the index and the middle finger is doing a triplet. One and two and shuffle. That kind of groove. So every variation will do through that same groove. Alright, so here's here's the whole thing. He does this little. <clears throat> oh yeah. Yeah. So what would the bass part be doing at that? Well, because I know he's got a little shuffle behind him. 
Yeah, but I, I would tell you this. If you're doing double stomps, and let, let me explain something. A lot of times in your chord play, when you're doing melody and trying to hold the bass down, it, you cannot put that many double stomps with it. In other words, see, you're doing a, a melody now that's got more than just the actual melody, because the actual melody would be... Now you got... Now, that, you, you, your fingers are moving too much to, to be able to put a melody on top of that. So, I mean, I don't know how a person would... Now, what would uh, an actual bass player be playing? Oh, he would just be playing a root. Da, 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 da. G5 C Okay, now you play the part A and G Now if you understand what I'm talking about the bass player is always playing the root and the fifth of the chord You understand that? So that's what you're doing, you follow the chord progression with that <clears throat> This is how Chad does it 